All right, here's the uh, ultimate to me a high lift video finished up hood. Uh, just wanted to show you guys what it looked like. Um, everything came out really good. Uh, a little bit of work, but uh, it was done. Had to, I still have to do a little bit of paint touch up door handles and a couple stuff but i was able to get a bunch of uh, video and a lot of pictures at the beach yesterday it came out really good but uh, this is the hood pretty flush pretty clean the only thing you'll see is just a little a little gap in the hood but uh use a razor blade but don't use the razor blade with the pointy edge. Use a brand new small pointy razor, but flip it upside down. Use the back side of the razor blade to, to cut your plastic hood out. Um, it, as opposite as you might think, it actually cuts better than the bladed side. It actually cuts nice flat grooves in it. But this is the hood. And all you have to do is just reach up and lift it um and you can slam it you know it's nice and heavy duty um the whole truck can be picked up by this whole hood um it's a super heavy duty truck with all metal um but if you open up the hood it's pretty sick um you can kind of see down in there you can see the uh you can see the motor mount or for the hood just basically uh let me try to do a little bit better zoom on here or you um, just drill a couple holes, make it fit, and then same thing, had some oval holes so you could uh, readjust, readjust it. But looks pretty good, added some little foam in there to try to make it look like a little insulating. Uh, key part, I showed this in a different video, but uh, what really helped were these br braces from here to here. And I would almost recommend putting them in now, even in a stock one. But you, all your, all your bumpers are connected to your body. So if you, if you do take your bumper off, um, I would recommend you could do like a little bracket underneath, mount it to the frame, do these little top pieces right here, and then I mean this thing is so I, mean, I can't. I'm using like all my might to try to flip this thing, and I cannot. Uh, this bumper's not flexing. Really important because uh, you know with a lot of weight and momentum behind this thing, if it hits something, um, it's going to do some damage now because. Uh, there is so much weight in this thing. I'm about ready to weigh it um, to see uh, to see how this how much this thing weighs, but uh, it's got some weight behind it. But uh, just a little video there of the ultimate high lift. Um, everything's pretty much done. I was out playing around with it. I'll have to do a little bit of fine tuning, add add a BEC in there, but. Uh, there you go, hood finished on the ultimate high lift hood. Done and ready to go. See you on the next video.